You were 17 when you joined the Marine Corps. Right. What made you decide to join the Marines at 17? Uh, my brother had been in the Marines and he was a sergeant. He'd come home like on a Thursday and wouldn't go back until the following Tuesday, every other week. And he had a new car and he had money in his pocket and he had a lot of girlfriends. <laughs> Now, what's a young 17-year-old What else could you possibly want, want yeah. right? <laughs> what, what else is there? Well, it didn't work out that way for me. <laughs> so you were joining in peacetime, basically. Right. And they sent me up to 8th and I in D.C. Okay. So it turned out to be a post, the oldest post in the Marine Corps. And that's where they had the silent drill team. I got involved in that. And I was there two years. We guarded the president when he went to Camp David, or Shangri-La, it was called then. Two years of that, and then you volunteered to go to Korea. Yeah, so that, uh, they put up a list on the uh, bulletin board at the, in the, our barracks, and they asked for 10 volunteers. I was one of the first to sign up. So when I get there, they said, we're gonna make this landing. We're gonna go on LSTs from Japan to make the landing get inch on. So when we get on the LST, we see stacks of two by fours. We said, what are we gonna do, build houses? And it turns out we were gonna build ladders. We were building ladders to climb up a seawall and none of us, nobody had ever done that before. But uh, next stop is Seoul. We're, we're leading the attack in Seoul. We're one squad on each side. The machine gun squad follows the rifle squad and they had machine guns up in the trestle and they opened fire on us going up and they cut down like the first five or six guys on each side of the street. So let's talk about Chosen. So we're on our way to Chosen and we're out there in the middle of this plateau and uh, we get surrounded. It's easy to surround us because, you know, we can't cover all that territory, we, you know, especially in the winter. And then the Army gets hit on the 25th of November, 1950. The 8th Army is in route retreat, biggest retreat in military history. And they left us up there and we're getting surrounded and they don't even tell us. Allman didn't even tell us to cut off the attack. They hit us with 150,000 men against 15,000 Marines. Now, any other battle, if you have those kind of odds, you're gonna lose. The Marines are special. There's something about them that if the chips are down, boy, you want the Marines on your side. They could be your worst enemy or your best friend. And I, I believe that. So it's safe to say you don't regret it? No. I, that was the greatest four-year adventure I ever had. 